I'm standing outside the DMC, where you may have noticed a group of students have set out to serve the Cedarville community through holding the DMC doors open for chapel goers. The first student to start holding the DMC doors was freshman Austin Perkins. Perkins, who began the first week of classes, is often joined by several other students, most of whom are freshmen as well. On the first day of getting started, weekend, we also have this, uh, we got a little band here that says go serve. And in my mind, that is one way that I can go serve. And I just wear it on my arm every day just to remind myself to try and serve the community and the people and God in every way I can. I'd want somebody to hold the doors open for me. Um, and it just, I don't know, just seems like the thing to do. I, I don't know. Why shouldn't I hold the door? Everybody just kept us walking by and they'd open the door and they'd swing and open the door and swing and open the door and swing and I was just like, oh, I'll just hold the door. It's simpler. I was standing there every day um, and then Katie uh, stood in the door next to me um, and then after that Josh came and it was just, we, that's how we met. We didn't know each other prior to holding the doors open. Both Macron and Perkins said that they plan to continue holding the doors open throughout the year. Though Macron said during the winter, the door holders might rotate who holds the outside doors open. A daily challenge the group faces is maneuvering the two doors open simultaneously. These students don't plan on stopping anytime soon. So if you're one of the ones that passes through these DMC doors, make sure to tell them thanks. I'm Crystal Goodremote, reporting for Cedars.